a dimly lit room cluttered with old books and memories, Michael stared at the aquarium, unaware that its shimmering water would soon change his life forever. Suddenly a peculiar voice broke the silence coming from the bright orange fish darting between the plants. Why do you look so lost, Michael? Taken aback, Michael rubbed his eyes, wondering if the stress of his life had finally gotten to him, but the fish continued, I'm here to help you find peace. With a mix of skepticism and curiosity, Michael leaned closer, asking, How can a fish possibly know anything about peace? The fish swam in a graceful circle, its voice steady and soothing. I've seen many souls through this water. I can show you the path to your own. Intrigued by the fish's words, Michael took a deep breath and replied, I'm willing to listen. What do I need to do? First, the fish said, you must envision yourself surrounded by bubbles, each one a thought floating away from your mind. As Michael visualized the bubbles, he felt the weight of his worries begin to lift, prompting the fish to encourage. Now, focus on each bubble as it rises, letting go of what no longer serves you. With each imagined bubble that popped, Michael felt lighter, the fish swimming closer and whispering, Good. Now embrace the stillness that follows. It is where true clarity resides. Opening his eyes, Michael was surprised to find the world outside the aquarium appearing more vibrant and alive, as if the colors had deepened. Remember, Michael, the fish urged, this practice can be your refuge. Whenever life becomes overwhelming, just return to this place of peace. Inspired? Michael took a deep breath and said, I will carry this calmness with me, ready to explore the hidden wonders of both underwater and within myself. As he stepped closer to the glass of the aquarium, Michael could almost feel the energy of the underwater world calling to him, a beckoning whisper of adventure. With his heart racing, Michael whispered to himself, what if I could dive into this hidden world and uncover its secrets? Taking a leap of faith, Michael envisioned himself submerged beneath the surface, surrounded by colorful fish and shimmering corals, feeling weightless and free. As he swam deeper into this imaginary realm, Michael encountered a magnificent giant sea turtle gracefully gliding through the water as if welcoming him into its world. Suddenly, the turtle turned its gaze towards him, and Michael felt a powerful connection, sensing that this creature held ancient knowledge far beyond his understanding. In that moment, Michael realized the true nature of the creatures around him. The fish, once innocent, revealed itself to be a cunning demon lurking in the shadows of the reef. As the realization struck him, Michael understood that the sea turtle was not merely a guardian, but a higher demon, embodying an even greater and more sinister power lurking beneath the surface. Gripped by a mix of fear and fascination, Michael questioned whether he could trust the seemingly benevolent turtle, or if it was merely deceiving him with its calm demeanor. Determined to uncover the truth, Michael decided to confront the turtle, asking, What lies beneath your tranquil surface, wise one? The turtle took a moment, its ancient eyes reflecting the light of the underwater world as it replied, Beneath the calm waters chaos thrives, and I am both the keeper and the harbinger of its secrets. Feeling a chill run down his spine, Michael pressed further. What secrets do you guard, and why have you chosen to reveal this to me? The turtle's voice dropped to a whisper, resonating through the water. You possess a rare gift, Michael, 
Your spirit can either bring harmony or unleash devastation upon this realm. Taking a deep breath, Michael realized the weight of his destiny as he asked, How can I ensure that my spirit brings harmony instead of destruction? The turtle nodded slowly, its gaze fixed on the horizon. To bring harmony, you must embrace the balance between light and darkness that exists within you and this world. 